Hey everyone, welcome to X Play 1000, a six hour celebration that means it's six freaking hours. Yeah, I know, it's long, but we're kicking things off with a marathon of your top 10 favorite X Play episodes ever as chosen by you, the fans, at g4tv.com. And it's all leading up to the biggest night in television history since last week. It's our X Play 1000th episode at 6 p.m. Yeah, we are going to be your hosts for the entire marathon. We're going to reveal X Play secrets during each and every episode. And throughout the day, we'll get your two cents yes. on Twitter and video viewer mail. Now, if we feature your viewer mail, we have a special surprise for you, a Morgan Webb autograph magazine. Why you would want such a thing, I don't know, but it's that's, pretty. What, that's what you get. Let's get this thing started with our number 10 episode. It is the robot episode, yes. which is a real corker. It sure is a corker. We filmed it right after the Fear and Loathing show in the desert, it, which, which is the thing that kicked off this insane trend of doing these big special episodes. I kiss a robot in this one. What were we thinking? All right, can I have everyone's attention? It appears that some of our viewers are feeling like our opinions are getting in the way of our reviews. So, in the interest of objectivity, I'd like to introduce you all to your new coworker. Wow, a robot! Yes, a robot. And you're fired. The robot's getting your cube. Oh my god. Now! What's the FV stand for? Actually, it's a Roman numeral. It stands for five. Oh. Can we call him Adam Five? What happened to the other four? I want to live. 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 Are you a mech-like killing machine not quite cool enough to make the Transformers League? Then pay attention. Huh? Nothing says loving like something from the Gundam. Here it is, Mobile Suit Gundam versus Zeta Gundam. Gargantuan robot hit everyone's been waiting for. I'm just kidding, this game sucks more bolt than RC on the weekend. Combat is frequently confusing. Yeah. Thankfully, the war zones are conveniently marked with orange day glow paint. Up top, you'll notice a battle gauge. Every time a team loses a Gundam, the gauge goes down. The first team with no more gauge loses. Isn't there an easier way to say it? How about just hit the X button until the round is over? That's better. I'll bitch slap you back to the atomic age, Robbie Rustass. When you win, you get a disco celebration. Good, the mission's a success. There's a nice variety of arenas for your Gundams to lock lightsabers and plasma swords in. Like the lunar service we've never been to and a Babylon 5 office park. You'll occasionally lose a limb and knock down a building or two, but overall the graphics are simplistic and offer very little to get excited about. Just about the only thing Mobile Suit Gundam vs. Zeta Gundam has going for it is the giant fighting robot. Mobile Suit Gundam vs. Zeta Gundam, Gundam's a two out of five. So what do you think, Gundam? Doesn't this look fun? Why are you standing up on that monitor? I know how you feel. Ooh, a download MP3s? A cook? Can I take it home? Will he raise my baby? I cannot believe you people. Look at you. Fawning all over that robot. I, for one, don't trust it. <laughs> I mean, come on, what's the worst that could happen? Here are the reviews for the rest of the year. for the entire network. Flip this switch and you shut it all down. You know, just click and then whoosh. All right, let me show you the water supply. You know, Adam Five is the best thing that's ever happened at X Place. Well, I still say he's a jerk.
What are you drinking? Coffee. Why are you drinking coffee? Because I'm tired and I need to wake up. But you are already awake. That's it. You may have everyone else fooled, but I'm on to you. I know what you really are. One of these days you're going to make a big mistake and I'm going to be right there ready to shut you down. Coming up, Adam 5 learns to laugh. Humans are all like, I'm mostly made of water. Robots are all like. <laughs> Is this device functioning properly? You suck, robot! Now that every pizza is just 10 bucks at Pizza Hut, you would not believe how much money I save. Well, my parents' money. Right now, any pizza at Pizza Hut is just $10. Any pizza, any size, any crust, and any toppings, only $10. Only at your Pizza Hut. In this home, a family grows. Children learn and play. Bonds are built. But before it was a house, it was a detailed drawing on a plan. The bachelor degree program in construction management in the School of Drafting and Design at ITT Technical Institute offers educational opportunities that can help students prepare for challenging and rewarding careers in the construction industry. There's a demand for individuals with knowledge and skills to manage construction projects. The construction industry needs professionals who can oversee construction projects in accordance with the plans and specifications. Thanks to the hard work and dedication of many, this dream became a home. There are still many more to be built. ITT Technical Institute School of Drafting and Design. Education for the future. To find out more, call 1-800-372-4052 or visit us on the web. Spit out your stry gum and chew another piece already, or we'll find you. Got the gum. The ridiculously long-lasting gum. New Stride Uber Bubble. Why just watch films and TV shows when you can learn to make them? Get behind the camera and turn your obsession into professional opportunities with the help of Collins College. Their Bachelor of Arts degree in film and video production can teach you about this exciting industry. You can learn skills in production camera operation or video editing call collins college today call now for a complimentary brochure call 888-823-0999 that's 888-823-0999 call now my favorite x-plane moment is when you guys were reading all the hate mail you got after the full metal alchemist review with the, the screaming intern and the drunken link you guys ugh. Jeffrey, it's after midnight. What are you doing? I'm buying car insurance. Right now? Yup. I just logged on to thegeneral.com. At The General, you can get an instant online quote that includes a low rate, low monthly payment, and a down payment as low as $59, even if you have tickets or an accident on your record. Okay, all done. Great. Bring me some cheese puffs. <laughs> the best car insurance rates online. Go to The General and save some time. It's no surprise that millions of Americans get married each year. But what might surprise you is that 2% of those newlyweds met on eHarmony. That's an average of 236 people a day. People who were looking for someone they could really connect with and found something much deeper on eHarmony. Only eHarmony matches you based on deep dimensions of compatibility. And that means you'll find something more meaningful from your first date onward. Try eHarmony.com today and review all your matches absolutely free. G4 celebrates Valentine's Day with a lineup of romance-free shows. Give me Kaye! Guilty pleasure yourself with a marathon of cheaters. You even clean the sheets before I come home? Then it's off to Sin City. It's amazing! For the 2010 Adult Entertainment Expo. 
Sasha Gray co-hosts. It's pretty fun. Celebrate a romance-free Valentine's Day starting at 9 a.m. only on G4. Man, that guy's in bad shape. Yeah, poor guy. His girlfriend left him for a robot. <laughs> well, that explains why he hates Adam Five so much. Why does he cry? Should I call a doctor? Well, he's just a little broken-hearted. If his heart is broken, how is he still living? It's just a figure of speech. It means his girlfriend left him, but he still really loves her. What is love? It's a human thing. I'll teach you later. I understand you suffer from a broken heart. Perhaps I can be of assistance. This heart appears to be functioning properly. Wake up. Are you a robot left behind? Are you a robot that wants more out of gameplay? Do you feel video games have abandoned robots to the proverbial scrap heap? Leave those robot dreary dreams behind you. These are games you've never considered, but my dear automatons, you should've. These are games for robot bastards. Robots love Mega Man. Mega Man is to robots, but Brett the Hitman Heart is to wrestlers. The best there is, the best there was, the best there will ever be. That's why any robot worth his rush should slowly, methodically amble on to the robot store and pick up the Mega Man Anniversary Collection. Tekken 4 is just one of many Tekkens that have titillated and tickled for years. But robots haven't paid attention. Robots just assume the game is only female life forms and bears to fight with. Not the case. We give you Combot, a robot not afraid to throw down with the ladies. In Tekken 4, Combot represents the robot race by taking down the quote unquote man. Which brings us to the mightiest of them all. Godzilla Destroy All Monsters Melee has all the monsters that have terrorized Tokyo for years, similar to how Will Smith has terrorized robots for years. But it also has Robotum's own movie monster, Mechagodzilla. And he's pissed. Nobody intimidates Mechagodzilla. From I Love the Godzilla 90s to Rodan to Godzilla 2000, all cower in the sight of this laser blasting, gas passing, foot stomping mecha. There's also a Mecha King Ghidorah, but that's just silly. Mega Man, Combot, Mecha Godzilla, these are their games. These are their lies. These are their robot lies. Robot gamers, find these games. Play them. Teach them robot love. You damn robot bastards. You win. What happened? Did Adam Five do this? Whoa, whoa, back up, back up. Robots don't kill people. I mean, there's a perfectly logical explanation. I mean, he probably did it to himself. Sessler, what? did you teach Adam Five to kill? No. I'm gonna kill you until you're ah. dead. You know what? I'm gonna kill you some more because you love it when I kill you. This is the most fun I've ever had. There's so much pleasure I know from taking your life away. This is fun. Kill, 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 kill. Oh, it feels so good. On a completely unrelated note, I think we have to remove Adam Five's brain. Okay. Big mistake. Wait, 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 wait. 
Anyway, there has to be an explanation. What's to explain? We want his brain. Brain! Look at him. He's resting in his bedroom. You mean the X-Play holding cell? I mean his bedroom. Adam Five, did you kill Paul? Yes. Mm, that sounds troublesome. Mm. But why did you kill him? If humans love and love causes pain, all humans must be destroyed. <laughs> His logic's undeniable. All right, here's how we're gonna get the robot's brain. Morgan and I are gonna hold him down. Morgan, it's very important that you have your foot at his throat. Got it. Then Leffler's gonna come with the tongs. Where'd Leffler go? Oh, no. I'm going in there. Look, it's gone. Left oh, no. no, no, left Hang on. Hang on. Oh, it's too late for me. Tell Adam Five I loved her. I Adam Five was male. Really? <gasps> no! Once upon a time. In a commodity-addicted, diversion-starved kingdom known as America, a plastic bundle showed up in the living rooms of suburbia. The year was 1985, and for 24,900 pennies, you got the Nintendo Entertainment System bundled with two controllers, two games, two? a light gun, five, five! and Rob, the gaming robot. Rob embraced his role as a happy mechanic of adolescent joy, employing his limited skill set as long as his batteries were regularly charged. But as we know, children, skies cannot always remain sunny. Rob began to forget his childhood role. He started to think he was better than a toy. He began spinning discs for the neighborhood robots. Rob's parties became the bits and bites of legend. The sharp chords of human inebriation began to commingle with Rob's vital lube. A mix that would prove most lethal. Dirty robot, dirty robot, drink, drink. After a while, Rob began to crave that which only humans could have. Rob wanted sensuality. Late one night, Rob and a robot of ill repute named Blogort began working on something no robot in history had ever had. It's magnificent. Other robots coveted Rob's bundled arrogance, yet they secretly wished for his downfall. Sick. He's sick, I tell you. What are you doing? Touch my dongle. I hear he is bisexual. Ah, uh, look at him. No, Rob, no. <laughs> I am burping. No. Better games came around and kids forgot about Rob. With his usefulness at an end, there was nothing left to do with Rob but melt him down and fill the cavities of grumpy old people. Oh, what do we do, what do we do, what do we do, what do we do? Wait, doesn't he have a remote control? Yeah, but I gave it to him. Okay, now why is he doing this? Well, I don't know, it's a robot, maybe that's what... <laughs> There are two types of robots in the world. Those that need to kill and those that need to be loved. This robot wants both. It's unstoppable and it's going to go on killing and loving, killing. Loving, killing and loving, killing. Loving, mostly killing, till there's no one to kill or love anymore. Ever. But truly there must be some way that we can stop it. No. Really? Well, there is one way, but you're not going to like it. Look out. Adam 5 is in the room. I don't see anything. Crap. Ah! This is Titan 1-4. No signs of life. Titan 1-4, hold your position. What do you got? Unmanned aircraft is identifying enemy sniper. Copy that. Let's move. Thanks, Reaper 
one one. Sensors coming off target. Learn more at airforce.com. I see you have the Verizon network. Yeah. You know, if you had AT&T, you'd have the nation's fastest 3G network. And you'd be able to download songs faster, download videos faster, and you could talk and surf the web at the same time. You got a little map in your soup. When you compare, there's no comparison. AT&T, a better 3G experience. Buy any smartphone after mail-in rebate and get any messaging phone free after mail-in rebate. Finding everything okay? I work for a different insurance company. My auto policy is just getting a little too expensive. With Progressive, you get the name your price option, so we build a policy to fit your budget. Wow, the price gun. Uh -huh. <laughs> I wish we had this. We just tell people what to pay. Yeah, we're the only ones that do. I love your insurance. Bill? Tom? Hey, it's an office party. The freedom to name your price. Only from Progressive. Call or click today. Hey, buddy, I appreciate the ride, you know? No problem. Mind if I take a shortcut? Yeah, sure. I knew the Subaru Legacy was the smart choice. What I didn't expect was the fun. The Subaru Legacy. Feel the love as we count down your top 10 favorite X-Play episodes ever. Now, you're about to witness the amazing ending of the robot episode. It all leads up to X-Play's 1,000 at 6. I met my wife on a blind date. It's my family that kind of got me started in the career path that I'm in now is in uh, ITT Tech. My wife was responsible for me going there. You know, we were actually driving right by ITT Tech. She said you should go in and just check it out. That definitely jump-started a lot of opportunities for him. It's nice to, to work uh, normal hours for a change and be home for dinner and be able to spend more time with my family. Uh, I know they really appreciate that. It allows me to provide for them in ways that before my education I don't think I would have been able to. We are educators helping people build a foundation for the rest of their lives. ITT Technical Institute, education for the future. Call 1-800-372-4052 or visit us on the web. Get an education that can help you reach your goals. ITT Tech has information on financial aid for those who qualify. Call 1-800-372-4052. If you had a choice between going between going bald and a fuller head of hair, which would you choose? Advances in medical science have resulted in the world's first and only permanent solution to hair loss. You wash it, you cut it. It's your own real naturally growing hair. When it comes to hair restoration, no one in the world has more experience than Bosley. The results look completely natural and are affordable on nearly any budget. Bosley hair restoration is a relatively simple outpatient procedure, but the entire process can't be explained in 60 brief seconds. So to find out more about this clinically proven permanent hair loss solution, call the toll-free number below to receive your free no-obligation information kit. It'll answer all of your questions about hair loss and hair restoration. Every day you wait, you're losing more hair. So don't put it off any longer. The phone call is free. The information is free. You owe it to yourself to find out the facts. Choose hair. Choose Bosley. Call 1-800-634-7223. That's 1-800-634-7223. Own a piece of G4. Download to own this show now. I hope this works, old man. It's our only chance. All right, I'm logging on to his frequency. Would you like to play a game? I will make the first move. On the bottom! No, but there, maybe... Bottom! Me, me, up there. Maybe, go there at the bottom! Okay, maybe here. No. I, at that you, side, but bottom. here. Bottom! You have lost. How do you lose at tic-tac-toe? This game cheats! With the arrival of 3D came a renaissance in video game robotics. Store shelves now offer a plethora of mech titles, 
But hey, anyone can pick up the latest Gundam tie-in or save up for Steel Battalion and its 800-pound gorilla of a controller. So for the connoisseur of Chrome Colossi, here are a few lesser-known mech masterpieces. For those who dig the turn-based stuff, Front Mission 4 may be your robo-poison of choice. This long and involving turn-based strategy game features hulking mechs, teeth-rattling weaponry, and the coolest mech intro sequence ever. Zone of the Enders The Second Runner is the criminally overlooked sequel to a pretty average action game. This game takes the framework of the original Zone of the Enders and cranks everything up to ridiculously high levels. It has a new art style, improved combat, and is unquestionably one of the best looking games of this generation. If you like your robots fast, furious, and full of pretty, why the hell haven't you played this game? Don't just sit there, go get it! Some of us would like to see a Zone of the Enders 3, you know. Finally, an obscure little gem that giant robot fans absolutely must play. Robot Alchemic Drive captures the scale and power of 40-meter titans slugging it out in urban environments like no other title. The majority of the time, you control your monstrous super robot from the perspective of the main character. You actually have to use the shoulder buttons to move each leg individually to walk and move the analog sticks around to operate the arms for punching and blocking. This is awesome and is worth putting up with the mind-bendingly awful story. I'm on my own now. I'm getting by. Somehow. Alright. And yet, despite the horrible acting, Robot Alchemic Drive sometimes serves up a heaping helping of comedy gold. Robots kill people! A robot killed Grandma! If ever greater words were uttered in a video game, I have heard them not. Grandma! You can always win when you go first. Well, now Adam 5 is going to kill us. Oh god, he really is! It's too late. He's already here. Oh my god, we're all gonna die! There are two types of robots in the world. The type that wants to kill, and the type that wants to be loved. 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 I'm going out there. Morgan! No! No! She's kinda crazy. The killing stops here. I cannot allow humans to suffer, so they must die. Love does not compute. I know it doesn't, but that's what makes us so wonderful. I mean, love hurts, but it's what makes us stronger. You know, love, love is inside all of us, even you. I do not feel this love. That's because love is about sacrifice. Sacrifice? You need someone to make the uh, sacrifice for. Adam-5 has no one to love. That's not true. That's not true. I love you, Adam-5. I love you, too. Oh, that's gross. Honey, the disposal's backed up again. Yes, dear. Remember, love is about sacrifice. Yes, dear. You suck, robot. <laughs>